Galileo called mathematics the language in which the universe is written. Numbers are fundamental to our understanding of the world around us, to our interaction with it. And in today's complicated, technology-driven world, good math skills are more essential than ever. Number processing takes place in a network of brain regions. The intraparietal sulci are active during subtraction, addition, and comparisons of physical size. The left angular gyrus plays a role in representing arithmetic facts like 9 times 5 is 45. And the inferior frontal gyrus is thought to be involved with mathematical demands for working memory and planning. Most people have a basic understanding of number. Other animal species and even human infants have been shown to be capable of performing some simple addition and subtraction problems. However, the more formal operations of arithmetic with number words and digits actually needs to be taught. And this teaching can take place outside as well as inside the classroom. The half a cup. The preschool years are especially important for developing these skills. Research shows that children entering their first year of school do better in math if they are already familiar with a few basic concepts, such as the number sequence from 1 to 10, and that numbers relate directly to the physical world. For example, that the number 3 means 3 of something, and that 4 means 1 more than 3. Because this knowledge seems so basic to adults, it's easy to forget that children need to learn it. Two plus two is but four. it doesn't have to be a chore. Four plus four Learning eight. about numbers Isaac. can be fun. One, two, three, four, five. The ability to estimate quantities is an important skill that develops very early and is something that we use in our everyday lives. Hmm, that looks like about 12 marbles to me. Recent findings have shown that the skill of approximating the number of items in a group is correlated with math achievement from kindergarten through sixth grade. There is also evidence that for children with difficulties in math, practicing number discrimination in a computer game can improve their subtraction skills. Also, Children in kindergarten, first, and second grade who do well at estimating score higher on standardized math achievement tests. And again, there are fun and easy ways to encourage the development of these skills. Math is important in our increasingly technological age, and people who are good at math are able to make more informed decisions in areas like personal finance, insurance, and healthcare, where numbers play a big part. There are many things we can do to help children build their knowledge of math, like playing games that involve numbers, calling attention to when math is used in everyday life, asking them to make their own estimations, These kinds of activities can help build a child's confidence with numbers and strengthen their math skills, preparing them for a life in which working with numbers is a necessity.